now you may be familiar with mail ballots started during the pandemic. Every active registered voter here in Nevada gets a ballot sent to them automatically. And most people who vote with a mail ballot simply fill it out, drop it in the mailbox. But some of you may choose to drop it off in person. If so, you're saving taxpayers money just to do that. And senior political reporter Steve Sibelius has been looking into this since viewer Linda Gannon submitted a question to ask Steve online. And he joins us now with the answer, Steve. Yeah, Tricia, Linda wrote in to tell us she dropped her ballot off at a voting center and wondered if doing that saved the county any money. Well, Linda, it does. According to the county, more than 129,000 people cast ballots in the February 6th presidential preference primary. Of those, more than 96,000 voted by mail. About 67,000 of them put their ballots right back in the mailbox. But the county says about 30,000 others chose to drop their ballots off either during a week of early voting or on election day in ballot boxes that are located at every voting center. Now it costs Clark County 68.8 cents per ballot to get those votes back to election headquarters, which means dropping ballots off saved the county more than $20,300 in the February election alone. Now, of course, Clark County encourages voters to participate in elections, whether they vote in person or by mail, and that includes votes sent in using the Postal Service. Although, it might not be a bad idea for somebody at the Government Center to invest in a few hundred thousand forever stamps before the June primary and the November general. Trisha Nabel, 